Now it's time to draw. The story, Two Dogs, book 31, number three drawing, can be found at zulu-who.de slash English. Let's see how well we can draw today. A bed, we're gonna draw the dog's bed. And that's just gonna be kind of like an oval. Like that. That looks like a bed to me, sort of. Yep, that works. There we go, that looks even better. Okay, let's try that again. We're gonna do two beds here. We'll do a, an oval and then go up a bit. And I think I'm doing this. I'm not doing this well. <laughs> Something like that, there's one. That was terrible. Let's try the other one better. Let's try an oval again. And then we come down and then we come up and close there, and then here's the back part of the bed. That looks a little bit better. This one was kind of messy. Let's try three beds. I'm gonna try and draw them like this. So I'm gonna draw an oval, almost all of it. Keep that part open, because that's where the dog goes in and out. This comes here and this comes here. That's the bottom of the bed. And there's the inside of the bed. That's pretty good looking. Let's try that again. Draw most of an oval. Gonna come down, that's the door where the dog goes in. And here's the back part of the bed. And one more time, here's an oval, down, off to the side, here's the bottom, and here's the back part of the bed. Three beds. <laughs> a cat, I'm just gonna draw a cat's head, I think. Here's a cat, well, with pointy ears, slitty eyes, triangle nose, and some whiskers. There's my cat, a cat. Let's draw two cats. Draw a circle to make it a little bit smaller. Little eyes, a nose, a triangle, there's the mouth, and some whiskers. And here's my next cat. Pointy ears, slitty eyes. Well, actually, yeah, I could have put an eye in the middle of those. Let's put that in there. Looks kind of missing without something there. Triangle nose and whiskers. Three cats. One. There's the ears, an eye, another eye, triangle nose, mouth, and some whiskers. I'm going to switch to another pencil. That one's not very sharp. Here comes a second cat. Two ears, two eyes, one nose, one mouth, and one, two, three, four whiskers. And here's cat number three. One ear, two ears, one eye, two eyes, one nose, one mouth, and one, two, three, four whiskers on our cats. Or this cat. So I have one, two, three, four, five, six cats. I also have one, two, three, four, five, six beds. Here I have to draw a hill, right? The dogs run up the hill. Here's a hill. Whoosh. <laughs> that was very easy to draw. Here I have to draw three hills. One, two, three. I'll do one and two and three. There's one in the background. There's three hills. One, two, three. Here I have to draw five hills. Maybe I won't draw these quite so big. One, two, three, four, five. There's one, two, three, four, five hills. How many do we have all together? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Nine hills all together. And now I get to draw a bug. Well, maybe I'll draw a ladybug here with some dots on her back. And one, two, three, four, five, six legs, a bug. And I can draw two bugs here. Maybe I'll draw a longer one, four, five, six. And another ladybug. Oh, that's a fat ladybug. One, two, three four, five, six legs. And here I'm supposed to draw four bugs. That's four, maybe I'll put five up here and three here and two here, just so you know. Four bugs, let's go draw. draw. Um, here's a bug. One, two, three, four, five, six. You know, butterfly is a bug too, so I'll draw a butterfly here. And a dragonfly is also a bug. Whoa, there's my quick butt dragonfly. Sorry, that was really fast. <laughs> he has one, two, three, four wings. 
and we'll draw one last butterfly, uh, le sorry, ladybug. One, two, three, one, two, three. And there's my four bugs all together. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven bugs.